daddy knows in the heads of God. On behalf of the family in Palm Heights, Montreal, and St. James, the Apostle Catholic Church, and the Paul Bears, we'd like to thank the family and friends for all your active kindness shown during the death of Brother Luis. Whether you brought food to the house or brought food to the visitation last night, sent flowers, made telephone calls, it was really appreciated by the family. But just remember one thing, that grieving don't end the day. You know, we're all different. Some people might grieve for weeks, some people are mine, and I know the immediate family probably for years. So that's why it's very important that you keep in touch with the family for the next few weeks or so. And family and friends, I want you to do me two big favors. Number one, don't text an email. Why are we getting so impersonal? It don't take that long to pick up a telephone and call someone. And I'm not talking about to your friends because I know you're going to text and email them anyway. But I'm talking about uh, to the family. Because during the time of death, two main things you need to hear a person's voice and see somebody's face. So please, if you can distrain for the next two weeks, please do so. And number two, number two, family, I'm geared to this myself sometime. Don't tell someone you know how they feel, because you don't. You don't. Parents don't grieve the same. Spouses, children, grandparents, grandchildren, nieces, and nephews. So if you're going to say anything to the family, tell them you're going to pray for them and you're going to come by and see them. But if you say that, make sure you mean it. Don't just say it to make the family feel good. And family, if you see that person on the street that told you that, you confront them. You say, I thought you said you was going to call me. I thought you said you was going to come by and see me. If they get mad at you, tell them Brady told you to tell them. <laughs> okay, but again, on behalf of Palm Heights Mortuary, we'd like to thank the family for putting your trust in us for having the funeral arrangement because you could have picked any funeral home that you wanted. If you need anything at any time, please let us know. And we're not talking about making funeral arrangements. If you just want to call and talk to someone, please do so. Because I have learned sometimes family is easy for them to talk to other people and family members because you're going through the same thing. So if you need somebody to talk to, I think everybody should know by now. My name is Grady. We also have Cynthia, James, and Julian working at the funeral home. If you need to talk to anyone, just ask for me. And I guarantee you they'll be glad to talk to you. But again, please keep the family in your prayers. Will everyone please do my favor, except the pallbearers, move over there to that area because the witness are, are putting them into the, uh, the crib.